slit the throat of this board. The gentleman behind me is a member of a cult. It's called the Barrier Cult, or Baku. And where we are is the genesis of their movement. It's a barrier. A big part of it is the barrier slowly turns into the representation of skating tight transitions. A barrier is like a pure representation of reaching vertical. Because once you do start to only skate these, it's basically all you want to do. We don't need to skate anything else. All we need is these altars here. So there's sort of a religious aspect to it. I would say more of a code. This is a World War I Hungarian bayonet that's been used a lot. When a nose of a skateboard goes into a barrier, it stabs a barrier. So this is like a representation of that. Part of our whole movement is that we're anti-notoriety. We believe that skateboarding should be less about individual personalities yeah. and the worship of, of anybody, or of any pro. Right. And so the anonymity of us comes born out of the idea that we don't agree with the worship of professionals and individual characters and barrier skateboarding specifically is not about notoriety and individuals. Skateboarding has become normalized. It used to be this outsider thing, but now it's an Olympic sport. You can go skating with your dad. I actually think it's amazing that skateboarding is getting normalized because it's just a fucking form of game. Skateboarders put so much self-importance on themselves. It was almost like a fluke that it became an outsider thing and that skateboarding's an art form and all this crap. There's been so much constructed ego in the world of skateboarding. The barrier call we've always thought of as like a martyr where it's just, it's deconstructed until we just don't even want to like ride our boards anymore. Are you getting there? I've almost quit. to go with you guys into the woods here. Okay. It does have a sort of like a pagan energy, this place. Everything wants to like reach vertical and trees are like the original reaching of vertical. I'd say maybe mountains and then the trees. Slit the throat of this board. Why? We come here to cut the throat of skateboarding itself. So it symbolizes the death of skateboarding. True. 